All right, so I think we should go and probably, you know, save the population right now. Seeing as how they're kind of being terrorized. So, let's go and take care of these protopets. The protopets are actually pretty uh, convenient for doing things like uh, increasing uh, weapons for upgrading. They're very good level ups. What is that? Oh, seems like the town god's here to save the day. Well, guess what? The town guard's gonna try and attack you too, so say screw them! And wait, we have a protopet supplier right there, so destroy those, otherwise infinite amount of protopets will show up. And there is no skill point for saving the people in here. There is the second skill point for saving the people inside of the bank that we're gonna be going to later. We're gonna have to save everyone inside that bank, and then we can get the second skill point for this planet. But for right now, we just need to go forward and, you know, do what we can, which is pretty much destroy everything. So, climb up here. I hope my mic sounds fine, ladies and gentlemen, because I think my mic's starting to go, unfortunately, and I kind of don't want it to go, because I don't really have too much money to, you know, replace it right now. Oh, die. There we go. And look at those ships. Time for swing shot. Whee! Whee! Oh, God, protopets everywhere. Die. Die. I love the plasma storm so god dang much. It's so beautiful for its shocking abilities and everything. Oh, wow. Did not see all those protopets right there. As you can see, this is a good place to get bolts, too, in case you need to go and buy some of those other weapons. Of course, I don't feel like grinding this much for all of them for later on, so, again, not getting the other ones. All right, uh, hit that. And let's keep going. Oh, hi, guys. Bye, guys. Well, that seems concerning. And seems like a glitch. All right. Gotta kill everything. Aw, oh, man, I'm out of Plasma Storm. Which means time for the Heavy Bouncer, one of my favorite weapons. Whee! Explosions everywhere! So great! Bye. Right, that gets rid of them. Now I'm gonna actually need to be careful when using this high explosive destructiveness because unfortunately, you know, I gotta save everyone in the bank. Right? Now one thing I find weird is the fact that I always thought that there would be a skill point uh, for destroying everything on these. There isn't. For some reason, these aren't affected by the box breaker and they don't give you really anything. They don't, there's no point to them. I don't understand. And it confuses and infuriates me. Nonetheless, anything behind here? Nope, just more boxes to break. So let's go over this way, and this is going to lead to where the bank is. So keep in mind, to get the second skill point, you're going to have to save everyone inside this bank. And that means the robot people. So yeah, don't hit, don't hit them by accident. Watch as I hit them by accident and have to kill myself. Right? do that and let's do plasma storm because plasma storm seems to be working wonders there we go I saved all the people inside here god bless the plasma storm god bless it seriously it just took everyone out so that is all these skill points that are on uh, planet Dilmos I always call it Dilmosel I, I keep on changing its name I swear but now we're going to go after the first of the Platinum Bolts. This one was actually one that I did not think about for a while. So what you're going to do is you're going to need your Therminator. And we're going to change this into ice. Okay, for some reason it was rapid firing, but I wasn't changing it. And once we change this to ice, we can go on right here. And what is it we're going to do? We're actually going to grind on this. Uh, how do I get on top of this? Yeah, and I think I have to get on top of this device because where we're going is a little inlet. Grind on here. And no, you can't make it to there in case you don't have the hypnomatic part. I've already tried. And here's the first of the platinum bolts. We're almost done with platinum bolts, actually, believe it or not. Which there is no skill point for getting all the platinum bolts. There is a trophy for getting all the platinum bolts, but there is no uh, skill point for getting all the platinum bolts. 
We actually only need four more uh, skill points left. No, actually, we need only two more skill points left, actually. And they're going to be on the final world. We're just about done with this game, ladies and gentlemen. Of course, I need to still show off the Insomniac Museum, which I'm obviously going to be doing, but... For right now... Die. Die. Don't worry, I'm not robbing the bank. I'm just taking out a withdrawal. You don't have an account here. I do now. Right. And... I almost have 300,000 bolts again. Anyway, the second of the Platinum Bolts is actually around here. Uh, we're going to need the Hypnomatic in order to get it. This was one that for the longest time, as you can see, we're going into the area. Uh, this was one for the longest time that I could not figure out how to do. And hopefully I still remember how to do it. Because it's kind of weird for getting this one. We're going to have to blow up one of the walls on this one because the Platinum Bolts on the inside. We're not going to be able to do it, though, until we get the Hypnomatic, which we're actually just about to get. So, yeah. Oh no! More of the security guys! What are we ever going to do? Why, I'm going to plasma storm it up, of course. I don't get why this is a cutscene right here. Goodbye! Do 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 do! God dang, the plasma storm's outrageous. Anyway, here is our next Jack and Daxter cameo here, again. Uh, that is actually the last one that is in the game. There are a total of three. Which kind of makes me sad because there's only one, you know, Ratchet and Clank 2 cameo inside of Jack 2. Come on. Come on, Naughty Dog. What the hell? Right? And you guys need to die because otherwise this door won't open. And here we are uh, inside here, which, again, is completely pointless. There's no point for any of these. I used to always spend my time just destroying everything here because I used to think that there was a skill point. But I was wrong. I was oh so wrong. I was lied to. Right? Uh, is there any more enemies? Because we can't leave this area until all the enemies are gone. Oh, Plasma Storm, you take care of everything. I'm actually remembering the last time I was at this point in Ratchet Clank 2. I think I was watching... Um, uh, what was I watching at the time? I think I was watching Chugga Conroy's LP on um, Pokemon Coliseum. Yeah, it was that. It was it was last year, really, that I actually did this. So yeah, pretty much. This is the last time I really remember it because I remember him playing that game, and I was listening to it in the background for white noise because I usually like doing that. I don't do it when I'm editing, but most of the time I'll listen to something in the background while I'm playing some games. Right? Boom! Nanotech boost. Right, I got rid of those two and. Gotta get rid of these guys. Oh man, I'm out of my shield. Quickly, my killanoids. Attack. Oh, killanoids. All right, so now we need to use the Terminator here again. And we're just about the end of this planet. So, freeze that up. And let us go up here to where we're going to meet two interesting characters that are actually voiced by other people. You're getting sleepy. Very sleepy. Uh, uh, you are getting very sleepy. Ahem. <clears throat> ah, a customer. You, sir, look like someone who could use a hypnomatic. Okay. Just bring us the part, and we'll make it for free. Ah, uh, for a fee. A very small fee. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. You know what's the hilarious part for that? That, uh, that is actually voiced by James Arnold Taylor and David Kay. Uh... The Hypnotist 1, which I believe is the Sock Puppet, is, um, I want to say that one's the one that's James Arnold Taylor. I don't know which one's which for the Hypnotist, but basically it's James Arnold Taylor and David Kay. But you need 10,000 bolts for the Hypnomatic. This is why you need to get those three parts and why I waited. So, let's get it. Use it wisely. Do not even think about it. So, to use the hypnomatic, target a receiver bot and press circle to take control of the robot. You are now my slave. So pretty much we have a 30 second time limit. This is basically how the um what is it called? This is basically the same as how the um Spiderbot glove is only it's a lot better. So, we need to go around. Uh, pretty much controls uh, are the same as Ratchet. You can jump, but you can't double jump. And that's it. So, 
Hit that button. And that will cause the taxi to come in. But we're not done here, ladies and gentlemen, because we still need to get the last of the platinum bolts that is on this planet, which is over this way. You need the hypnomatic in order to be able to get to it, otherwise completely useless. Right, go over this way now. And actually with the hypnomatic, we now have every single gadget in the game. So what we're gonna do is we're going to uh, find a vantage point for this guy. There we go. And now, ow, jerk. One of these walls ends up leading us to where I need to go. I wanna say it's this one. I'm trying to remember how to open this. Give me a second. I wanna say that I blasted open, but I could be wrong. Anyway, when you run out of time on this, you explode. And you gotta restart the whole thing again. Not fun. Anyway, these robots will pretty much attack you like dicks. Right. Right, so let's get rid of them. I got rid of them. Now, it's this wall right here because I can see it. There we go. Okay, you just have to detonate it yourself. So pretty much if you hit the triangle button, it will blow up. But here we go. That is the second platinum bolt for Planet Del Mose, which means we are completely done with this planet, ladies and gentlemen. It's actually kind of a long episode now that I see about it. But anyway, guys, I'm going to end it off right here. This is Roxas 1359 Next time, we're going to head back to Planet Gremlin to finish it up, and then we'll have the last world of the game unlocked. See you guys then.